Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Wrestling Fray and welcome to another episode or segment of Belting It Out. Now, this is going to be the very first episode of Belting It Out where it is not necessarily a new belt day, but it is uh, an accessory for a belt that I have. So we're going to get to that, but before I do that, I will explain why I am in the studio and not the lab. So the lab is gone. The lab is turning into a nursery for my soon-to-be newborn child coming early next year. So yes, I'm going to be a father again, and that child gets what was the lab. So I moved into the studio along with Jimmy, and as you see, I made some improvements. This way, this will allow me to get more belts, and will allow my wife to say why do you need more belts anyway as far as the accessory i have tonight what do we have we have the side plates for my wwe championship and of course they are the man who won the wwe championship at the last wrestlemania that i attended kofi kingston now I was never a fan of the side plates. I see people collect them a lot, but when I open this box and I see how beautiful these things look, <laughs> I'm like, wow. So yes, we will be putting this on today. Now I know a lot of people, they'll show you it and the next thing will be like, oh, side plates are on. But nope, we're gonna go through the entire process together. Let's do this. Take me away. I want to see the oceans roar and the mountains move. Let's escape home to a place where dreams are doors you can't walk through. Transformation complete. Got the side plates on there. Um, that was actually a lot easier than the one guy I saw do it on YouTube. Uh, he was having a few issues, but um, these seem to line up pretty well actually. And as far as where this is gonna go, And there it goes. Of course, I didn't set the lights up up there quite yet, but hope you do like the thing. Now, one thing about, that I was excited about Kofi winning the belt. I was a fan of Kofi Kingston ever since he came to WWE. I don't know, it was just something about his charisma that just kind of drew me. So after the whole follow-up thing happened after the Orton thing, I figured he was just gonna be relegated to mid-card for rest of his career and I was content with that. I was still a fan but when Kofi Mania happened I got super excited so I, I want y'all to understand I would be in the exact same way if Cesaro ever wins the WWE Championship because I'm the same way with Cesaro but Kofi I've definitely been a fan since day one. Alright uh, thanks for uh, tuning in to Belting It Out and Y'all have a wonderful day, wonderful night. Enjoy. <laughs>